Hi everyone and welcome back to the Gamma Stock and Mod Pack. Today I want to talk about disguises. This is a little bit complex, but also pretty straightforward in the grand scheme of things. A lot simpler than some of the other mechanics in the mod pack. So a disguise is, as you might imagine it, a change of clothing. So if we bring up the PDA, I just want to read through what's in here first. So in the guide, you've got the Gamma Manual and then you've got the disguise. You can wear other factions armor to be considered a member of that faction if the faction patch is attached. If you tear off the patch, you'll be considered as a member of your character's faction, so the one you started as or the one you have joined. When attaching a patch, you need to be out of the field of view of other stalkers so your disguise doesn't blow up in your face. Pretty obvious, yeah? This feature is very powerful with the ecologist armor because ecologists are pretty friendly to everybody, I believe. But they're hard to get your hands on in Gamma. The condition of the armor impacts how easy you will be spotted. So the worse the condition, the easier you're going to be spotted by them. So if you want to be really sneaky around a military base, for example, you're probably going to want to repair the armor first. High ranked stalkers will see through your tricks more easily than lower ranked ones. So there are multiple factors here. And there's a couple here that aren't mentioned. How you behave also has an effect. If you walk and don't have a gun in your hand, you're less likely to be spotted. If you whip out a gun, it's going to make it more easy that you are spotted because that seems unusual even if they have their guns out. Don't ask me why, that's just the mechanic. So right now I am wearing my clear sky body armor but the patch is ripped off now it's a little bit buggy sometimes but you can equip the patch again what i'm actually going to do is take off the armor okay so it's in my inventory so now you can see that clear sky faction patch has been torn if i put this on nothing happens i'm just wearing my armor now if i right click and click attach patch and then i go there you can see at the bottom it came up with you are now appearing as clear sky. If I now remove the patch, I am now free stalker again because that's what I am. And I can do the same with military armor. You can only switch the patch between you, your faction, and the faction the armor belongs to. So let's put the military service outfit on there. So with this outfit, most stalkers will assume you are part of the military. And this is where I hope there's no one behind me who's about to shoot me in the back. If I go back to the inventory, I can strip off that patch. And there you go, I'm now free stalkers again. If I go in and attach the patch, I'm part of the military again. As I say, I found that it could be a little bit buggy with my original clear sky armor. And I don't know if that's just because I've updated from an old save and I haven't taken it off and put it back on. That's why I took it off and then put it on before I started messing with it. So just bear that in mind. Also, it helps if you're out in the open doing it, because obviously if you're stood in a base, people are going to see what you're doing anyway. So make sure you're doing it where you can't be seen. Now, I'm going to walk up to this military base. I'm going to jog slightly, but I don't want to, I don't want to run into it because that makes it really obvious, it appears. But I will demonstrate that as well. So... This is the military checkpoint in Corden. Uh, there are military guys here, as you can see. Right now, I appear as a military guy. If you look at the bottom of the screen, do you see there are little bars appearing? I will try and zoom in on those as well. The higher they go, the more likely you are to be spotted. You'll notice they're changing color. They started off as green. Now they've gone a light greeny yellow. They'll gradually go yellow and then orange as they are now and then eventually they will go red. Basically, this is the military guy spotting you and going, hang on, why are you there? You're in the wrong place. That guy there isn't a very high level clearly because he didn't spot me. There's a load sat around here on the corner around a campfire that are much higher level. When I walk near them, that bar is going to skyrocket. I shall demonstrate. Already going up, going up, going up. It seems to give you a little bit of time. It's not instant. They obviously need time to become more suspicious. 
But if I get closer, it will go up faster. See, they're all slightly agitated. They've put their musical instruments and stuff away. There it is going up. If I try and talk to this guy... There you go. I got too close. And immediately, I'm getting shot to pieces. And you'll see it says, This guy's an enemy shoot at once. So they, they didn't realise initially who I was. But that's it. The disguise is broken. You cannot recover from that, I don't think. Okay. So this time, I'm going to approach... Running... And with my gun out. And we'll see if they notice me any better. I can't see if there's a guy on the gate this time. Yeah, there is. So there you go. Guy on the gate. As I say, he's a rookie on guard. So he doesn't spot as well. But let's see if he can see me any better this time. As I run at him with this gun out. So we're already at one little bar. Three little bars. Four. Five. It's getting higher than I was last time, definitely. Orange, red. So yeah, running with your gun out definitely makes a difference. It just kept going up there. It didn't but now I'm walking. Even though I've got my gun out, it is going down, but I'm I'm not as visible to them. I'm sort of out of the way. If I put my gun away, does it go down any faster? Having my gun out there, they could see me and it's gone yellow again. I'm not sure if it's better to keep moving or not. But it is yellow right now. Now it's going back down to green. A military guy there looking at that. Basically, this is allowing me to freely walk around. And explore. But, obviously, I can't get close to these people or they spot me immediately. And that's likely in relation to what I'm wearing being damaged. So I assume that if I increase the quality, then that will improve. Well, that's very interesting. Let's get my gun out, and we'll just have a walk through here. I'm going to run again and just see. Now, he's not looking at me, but can he tell that I'm... Pointing the gun at him is the question. It is going red. But it could be the people at the campfire can see me doing this. That goes up when I aim at him, look. See how it goes down when I zoom back out? But if I'm pointing at him... There you go. Good. So there you go. That is the disguise system. Basically... You can do it with whatever armor you find, as long as it has the patch attached still and relates to that faction that controls that area. So you can do it for military, you can do it for freedom, you can do it for duty, you can do it for monolith even. Obviously the ecologist one would be the dream if you can get that, since most people are friendly to the ecologists. Well there you have it folks, so that is the disguise system. It's not too complex, but there are some factors to take into account. Let's recap very quickly. You need a piece of armor with the patches still attached belonging to the faction that you are trying to approach. You need to walk without your gun out for it to be more effective and the better the quality of the armor in terms of its repair status, the better your disguise is going to be. If you run or have a gun out or point a weapon at them, they will become suspicious very quickly. And if you change patches at all with anyone around, your disguise is already null and void. So keep that in mind. You have to be hidden from anyone else. Out in the middle of nowhere. You might get away with it in a building. I'm not sure. You'll have to experiment a little bit. But there you have it folks. Disguise system. Not too bad. I wish you the best of luck experimenting with this. I know it can be very handy for grabbing certain stashes that will appear in 
military bases and such the like. So, good luck with your experiments. Let me know how it goes down in the comments below. Thanks for watching, everyone. Please do like, share, and subscribe, and I'll see you all soon for some more Gamma.